So for this example, we're going to learn how to convert a mixed number into a decimal. So what is a mixed number? A mixed number is a combination of a whole number, which in this case is a 4, with a fraction, which in this case is an 8, 1 eighth. So how do we convert 4 and 1 eighth into a decimal? Well, we begin by taking our whole number, which is a 4, and placing that on the left of our decimal. So we, for, we could forget about this 4 for now. Now all we have to do is convert our 1 8 into a decimal, and we're going to go ahead and put whatever we get on the right side of our decimal. So how do we convert 1 8, which is a fraction, into a decimal? Well, in order to convert a fraction into a decimal, we take the numerator, which is the top number, and we divide it by the denominator, which is the bottom number. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's divide 1 by 8. How many times does 8 go into 1? Well, 8 can't really go into 1 because 8 is a bigger number than 1. So what we're going to do, we're going to put a decimal next to our 1, a decimal on the top, and we're going to put a couple of zeros next to our decimal. So how many times does 8 go into 10? 8 goes a total of 1 time into 10. 8 times 1 is 8. We're going to subtract 8, and 10 minus 8 is 2. Now again, can we divide 8 into 2? No, because 8 is a bigger number than 2. So we're going to have to bring down one of our zeros. And now, how many times does 8 go into 20? Well, 8 goes a total of 2 times into 20. 8 times 2 is 16. We're going to subtract 16. 20 minus 16 is 4. And we're simply going to bring down our other zero because we can't divide 8 into 4. And how many times now does 8 go into 40? 8 goes a total of 5 times into 40. And we want to continue going till we have a remainder of 0. And in this case, we have a remainder of 0. So now that we've got our decimal, which is 0 0.125, we just simply have to place that number to the right side of our decimal over here. So we're going to go ahead and put 1, 2, 5. So 4 and 1 eighth is equivalent to 4.125. That is our answer.